Hello there, Wild Sauce appeared. My recording cut out, so this is me trying to redeem it. I'm sorry you missed some zombie killing. If this happens again, I'm gonna have to reconsider. Oh no. Is that a zombie or, or a person I can't tell next to me? Or wasn't anybody next to me? Oh my god, that was weird. That wasn't right. That ain't right! Okay, so yeah, I teleported down to Manzita Post to get myself here. You, you understand what? Wait, that's a zombie noise? This was not the only one left. There's another one here that's attacking the village. Don't you lie to me, game. So yeah, you missed out on this huge epic zombie fight. I'm horribly ashamed of myself. But once again, you can't, you can't uh, just blame the the gods of the HD PVR. You know, because I'm sure he has some sort of deity prolific system. But yeah, you don't want to think about touching touching corpses. It's it's not a fun process. It makes me wonder who the fuck like hire who the fuck goes into doctor uh, doctors or whatever. Who becomes a fucking mortician? Who in their right mind decides? You know what? I think I'm going to spend my life being paid to touch corpses. To open up corpses and put stuff in corpses and dress them. Who, who makes that into a profession? I ask you. I couldn't do it. Your mom can't do it. I, your dad would have to be pretty fucking metal or a fucking creeper in order to do that shit. I couldn't do it. I'm gonna touch it. It's like ew, it's cold. The skin feels like rubber. Huh, I got some doc Coca-Cola, some Dr. Cola here. Just in case my voice gets dry doing all this shit. Because it, it easily happens. It easily happens. You don't. You never know when your voice is gonna go. I can't wait for the day when just like I find a, this YouTuber whose voice suddenly goes in the middle of like commentary. Like utterly, utterly goes until he's like a raspy voice that just grinds on your ears. Like fucking Usopp's nails on a chalkboard. Yeah, that's... Lady? Are you okay? Lady, where are you running? Lady, don't make me hurt you. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, she's one of the people in the town. She was the one that I saw who was, like, running by me. Like, there was... I think that was in the last recording before the thing fucked up. Luckily, it was only, like, five minutes of recording that it fucked up. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm here to save you, mortal man. Hello, sir. Uh, hello. Oh, there you are. Okay. Whoa. Now, who am I? How about... No, how about I not accept you your challenge and you shoot you anyway? Too, now, uh, that's easy. That's easier, I'd say. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. They're coming anyway. They're coming anyway. Get out. Get them out. Get back here. I, I was so, I was afraid that it would, uh, that it, the glitch would appear where the zombies would just, like, hook to your character model and just, like, tear you off the horse even though you're running. And by the way, don't let your horse run in that fire unless you've got an undead one. Otherwise, otherwise you're just asking for it to your own guy to die. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I don't know where to go. I think I have to go in here because this is the first time they're letting me in this building. Isn't it? No, no, I think you can go in here beforehand. It's just this is the first time, like, when it's actually necessary. Sure. Here's my revolver ammo, even though I need it. Try to get the jump on you. I'm... What? Trying to... You're trying to get the jump off? Oh, I did not want to fall in that water. I'm just... I'm just a humble cowpoke. I can't swim. I can't swim. Fuck that shit. I was also talking about snuff films and the questionable idea of their actual existence but in the uh, in the missing part, in the lost files of this playthrough. And oh, no horse, not right now, no walkies right now, I need to get, deliver some ammo to peoples. Okay, so closest one, ow, ignore that, ignore my pain. The pain of being slapped by a zombie who does not know the idea of fucking, of, come on, vitality or what have you. Stamina, stamina, that's it. Alright, so if I remember correctly, I did not remember correctly, I don't know how to get this lady. 
the this is me trying to evade her no zombie prostitute yep 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 and yep perfect oh my god he just walked through the fucking building mamma jamma oh god wow i did not mean to do that either hey lady oh you're you're down here now so it's okay if i give you the ammo uh oh Okay, so I'll do that instead. Oh my god, your nose is missing, man. There we go. Ah, shit. Hey, you on the horse, come back here and help defend the country. Or America. Oh, Jesus. Oh, well, there goes the lady, I think. No, 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 I am not a meal. I am a, I have rights. I have fucking rights. Maybe, maybe. And be touching the zombie on the forehead, just delicately. Lightly tap them with my with my burning steel. I mean, lead. Close enough. Oh god, they're both elements, it's okay! Actually, it's not an element. Steel is far from an element. It is an invention by man. It's like saying... Well, actually, iron is, a, is an element, so you can't really say anything bad about that either. Ah, can't climb fences, you stupid bitches! Can't climb those fences! You're gonna have to get around them like like these guys here. Uh oh, uh oh, Fatso, Fatso, back off, buddy. I got your number. Man, all of those models have fucked up noses. Uh, put one foot in front of the other. Uh oh, uh oh. Hey, oi, prick. Yeah, that's the Shaun of the Dead reference. The Shaun of the Dead reference in zombie game. Holy shit, stop the fucking presses. Oh man, see, see, once you get into this shit, that's when they start, like, that's when they start rampaging against you. They're like, okay, okay, our numbers are dwindling, we gotta, gotta step it up, fellow zombies. Uh, that was their leader talking. You know, everybody's favorite leader. That was Wesker, basically. I don't know much about Resident Evil Universe, because I'm much more interested in the good universes. hey -oh! oh no, I just... I just lost some more subscribers, let me tell you one thing. Don't make an enemy out of your subscribers, folks. Don't do what I do. Get out. Come on. Are you going to die or just stand there? Either way will work for me as long as you're not eating at my... Eating at my face! I wish this thing didn't have a scope on it and that it would make shooting closely a less of a uh, awkward thing. All right, let's point out. Oh, there she is. Hmm, that zombie ass though. I saw it. I saw it. You saw it too. Uh, hmm. Yeah, okay. It's that other one's way, way over there. Come on, Marston. You went over it before. You can do it again. Gosh dang it. Actually, you know what? While they're taking care of it, let's let's search some more zombies. We need some more fucking ammo. Cause my God, this place drowned the living fuck out of it. Hello. I need some more zombie, I mean, some more zombie corpses. Yeah, that makes sense. Zombie corpses. What could go wrong? Uh, I could have sworn there was another one I got here, but... Oh, wait, there she is. Yeah, this, she isn't gonna utilize results. Unfortunately, zombie women aren't as truthful as their... Oh, God. Oh, God. It hurts. It hurts. Girls on fire. Oh, okay. Whew. I almost felt like, uh... Michelle Pfeiffer in Dark Knight Returns. You remember that? Nobody remembers that. Yeah, <laughs> it's because it didn't happen. <laughs> okay, let's take care of this one last guy. Huh. My goodness, see, he's. There, there. There it is, okay. Man, these guys are shit A. And so am I, apparently. Take care of it in the cheap way. Perfect. Yeah. Now let's collect some loot from this place because, man, this is the one problem, I mean, problematic thing with this game is that like, here we go. I mean, with this DLC is that like it cost, the cost is definitely not entirely worth it. it it depends on how skilled you are at the game. Like, once again, if I used, like, the, uh, the, uh, aim assist, I would probably have, uh, 
more appreciation for the spare ammo in comparison to what I lost. But since I since I decided to be a ballsy man, or try to be, I'm not, I have to just sort of go with the flows, homeboy. Yeah. Don't try to be hip, Silas. Stop trying to be hip. It's okay though, because I'm admitting to sell uh, to selling out, which means it's okay. It's okay to sell out if you're admitting you're selling out. It worked for Fallout Boy, didn't it? Ah, uh, ah, uh, good old. This is, they won't die. I'm sure Fallout Boy will stay popular forever. They'll be they'll be the next uh, the next Scritty Politi. No, I'm sorry, Scritty. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it, Scritty. Take me back. Take me back. Zombie wolves. I dealt with you plant with your living counterparts so too much in the old game, and now they're coming back to reap their vengeance on John Marston in his jammy jams. Ah, uh, as for well, this old Bacchus place. This, ladies and gentlemen, is. I mean, who am I kidding? 90%, 99% gentlemen. Seth. You Actually, okay? it's 97 last on? time I checked oh, hey in the level. Fancy a game of cards? Not right this minute. <laughs> you remember Moses, John? Yeah, I do, actually. He's, I, oh, he's oh a, my a god! He's side more loyal now <laughs> than he was before. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, boy. Come on. Oh, he's a nice guy. Come here, boy. This is weird. What are you doing? We were boyhood friends, John. Oh, that is so nice. Look at him, he's smiling and everything. Ain't you, pal? <laughs> What's going on? We're playing cards. Relax, sit down. I mean, with the undead walking the face of the earth, you crazy dumb bastard. That ain't nothing. Ain't nothing? I've seen husbands eating wives. Mother's eating sons. Graves popping open and the undead rising up. It sure as shit is something. Oh, boo-hoo. <laughs> Big tough John Marson has scared a little undead creature walking around. Moses wouldn't hurt a fly, would you, darling? Besides, <coughs> this ain't nothing new. Folks in Blackwater blaming it on that glass eye you found. <sighs> Folks! <coughs> Folks! Folks! Damn them folks, John Marston! Damn them! And damn you! Oh. Get them! Get them, Moses! Get them! After all I've done for you, Seth, oh. and I thought loyalty was important to you. You can't hurt me. Moses, get them. <laughs> Go! Yeah. Get them! Get me, Moses. Looks like your dog's lost his bite, Seth. Now what the hell's going on? The dead have risen, and a virulent plague is turning people into flesh-eating crazies. What the hell you think's going on, genius? But why? But why? 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 Why not? Why not? <laughs> why the hell not? Because it ain't natural. Who made you Mother Nature and Mother Superior all at the same time? Who made you, John Marston? Same as made me. Same as made Moses. Is there a cure? <sighs> These things tend to fade away. Now, if you want to get rid of it, you should go clear the graveyards. Either that, or stop worrying and become one of them. Now, if you excuse us, we got good times to remember. Happy times. Okay. See you soon then, Seth. Come on, Moses. It's your deal. Diamonds are trumps. Come on. Now that scene is go. Whoa! I have a golden gun. I don't know how it happened. I got one. I got one of the golden guns. I oh, they're back! Ah, oh, hell, they're back! 
Ah, uh, they got again. Ah, uh, they got again. Ah, uh, just the one. Okay. Anyway, um, and no. Uh, the what I was going to say about that scene is that it works so well, and it makes me love like Seth's character oh so much, so much, and it it furthers the it's more. Uh, how do you put it? It satisfies me a lot more than any other character has when it comes to, you know, the quote-unquote Seth types. You know the ones. Like, there, there, there tends to be, like, one in every two or three ga two or three out of four games where there's just this character that just fucking chews at the scenery like like a fucking chipmunk. Let me tell you what. But the, the thing that separates Seth, I feel, from all of them is when you see the contrast, uh, the contrast between, uh, oh, hello, voice in my head. Yes, I can. Hurry up, though, because there's, I hear, I hear, they're right there, they're right there, woman, oh, God, oh, no. Never leave a man to do a man's job. I'm saving the damsel. Trying to, anywho. Oh no, she's dead. Oh Jesus, I nearly shot my horse. Oh well. Come back, horse! I mean it! Anyway, like the contrast between that scene is, is omni important to me. And let me explain my reasons why. It's because, like, when you contrast this game. And at this DLC and the original game, Let's go. you get to see Seth in what they consider to be the common world. And he's this sporadic little, like, crazy lonesome rascal. And then when hell has risen and everybody else is freaking out, he is just chilling being the most normal person that there ever has been. Basically what I'm trying to say here is that the, there is a genuine oh, method to his madness as opposed God. to like, as opposed to like say Trevor or, and other folks from, uh, from the GTA series. Does that make sense? I hope it does. And it, it just furthers my appreciation for a character that I love that some people actually tend to not. I mean, uh, I mean admittedly, he's a weird one, but like, like people tend to love Trevor, and like he's he's fine. I mean, he's better than than fucking Franklin, but at the same time, I feel like like set. Oh no, she smacked my ass off that cliff. Well, clip out that rooftop. Back off! I want to give somebody the proper weaponry to destroy you. Which why I'm gonna destroy you right now. That's that's the logic. That's the logic I'm going with. I'm sticking with it. Wow! They just shot me, despite me clearly trying to help. What a bitch! What a bitch! Uh, oh, no, 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 no! Ah, 